and welcome to my crafting room or my she shed today's video is going to be the first video in my Halloween series I hope to get out uh, as many videos as I can this uh, upcoming what is it about 18 days left before Halloween uh, because I'm making my Halloween decor so I've been here for about a week and I'm going to be here until Halloween I think because I have a lot of things I want to make I have started with what I thought was going to be the easiest first and that is folk and folk for those of you who do, do not know Harry Potter uh, as well as I do or <laughs> many others do folk is a phoenix a bird phoenix and uh, you, you may have heard even though you don't know Harry Potter you may have heard about bird phoenix how they die go up in flames and then rises from the ashes again um, and that's uh, how it is with Falk as well. Falk is uh, the principal of Hogwarts uh, pet, his or companion, uh, animal companion. Uh, he's a male phoenix bird uh, and he's very important to the uh, plot or the uh, the story in the second Harry Potter movie uh, that chamber of secrets last year i also had harry potter as a theme for my halloween but i based it more on the first movie so this year i'm going to base my decor on the second harry potter movie which is the chamber of secrets so without any further ado uh, here's how i made fork the bird phoenix from harry potter so today I will be making the phoenix, the bird phoenix from Harry Potter and I'm not going to make the whole bird as you can see I already have a bird this is a plastic bird I bought uh, at a store where they have birds to big birds to scare off uh, little birds uh, the kind you can place in your garden uh, I guess the English word is a hawk I think um, and as I said it's plastic so the first thing I have done is I tried to kind of using the knife and I'm going to use some sanding paper uh, try to remove as much as I can of the the seam from where when the bird was made then I'm going to paint the bird with acrylic paint uh, mainly yellows reds oranges yeah orange uh, and then I will use feather large feathers like this for its tail and then smaller feather in the same feathers in the same color scheme um, reds oranges do you say that oranges yeah orange and yellow and I will glue those on and hopefully it would it will look like a beautiful uh, bird phoenix when I'm done.
So this is how far I got with my bird yesterday and today I have been out buying some air drying clay uh, because I want to do some work on his face as, focus. as you can see it's kind of it's looking too cute in a way so I'll try to do some modeling or shaping of his face with the clay That's my painting all done uh, and I think it turned out okay. I'm not a very good painter but yeah it's good enough. Uh, so now for the feathers and I'm going to start with the head. Uh, I'm going to I think use uh, hot glue. Um, yeah I, I haven't tried before so I have to, to see how that works. Uh, I didn't have uh, stripy feathers, so I painted some red feathers with black and gold. That was not easy. <laughs> it didn't come out uh, perfect, but I think it's going to look okay when, once I get it on the bird. So now for the gluing of the feathers. I have begun uh, attaching the tail feathers. Not sure about the technique here, but I'm trying to glue them on. I was thinking about drilling holes into the bird, but I want to try this first and see if I can get this to work. So I'm going to use yellow, orange and red feathers for this.
I hope you got some inspiration from uh, the video and that you liked my uh, fork. Uh, I think he turned out beautiful uh, and it kind of looks it's it's not a replica but I think it's it's good enough and uh, as you saw I also got inspired to make uh, fork as a baby rises from the ashes um, I hadn't planned on, on doing that but I had some old clay that I wanted to see if I could make something out of and uh, from that came baby fork okay guys I don't know what my next video is going to be I think it's yeah I, 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 I'm you have to wait and see uh, thank you so much for watching guys please leave a comment and give the video a thumbs up if you liked it uh, I hope you will subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to see more of my videos and know when I upload. Be safe guys, uh, have a wonderful week and I hope I see you for my next video. Bye!